Hey, it's Dr. Cherokee, and in this video, I'll be talking to you about what is managed care pharmacy. Now, when I was in pharmacy school, I thought that managed care pharmacy was either medication therapy management, and that's all it was, because that's all I was doing, or it was like working for the bad guys, you know, the, ins the big bad insurance companies. Um, and obviously that is not the case. Managed care pharmacy is not just MTM and it's not necessarily just working for the bad guys. So I'm going to share with you the association of managed care pharmacies definition of the field of managed care pharmacy. So here's what they say. The practice of managed care pharmacy applies clinical and scientific evidence to support the appropriate use of medications to enhance patient and population health outcomes while optimizing use of limited healthcare resources. Yeah. It's very general. You can't really gleam a lot about what you would actually be doing as a pharmacist in this field. So I like to think of managed care pharmacy as a big umbrella term. And there are a lot of different roles that pharmacists can play within this big umbrella of managed care pharmacy. So here are some examples of different types of pharmacist roles in managed care. You have coverage determination or prior authorization pharmacists. You have formulary development or management pharmacists. There are quality assurance pharmacists, specialty pharmacy pharmacists. Uh, medication therapy management pharmacists, which I'm very fond of, informatics pharmacy, and then of course within all of these roles there has to be some kind of hierarchy, so managers or supervisors or even directors of that department, and that was not all-encompassing. But in managed care there are a lot of different avenues and skills and strengths that you can kind of get into, and I go into a lot more detail and depth about these different uh, kinds of roles in pharmacy, what they do and stuff like that. I have another video that's in my managed care pharmacy playlist that you can find here. And I also talk about it a lot in my managed care pharmacy ebook that you can get at the link below, um, which also talks about how to get into the managed care field, um, what it is and what you can do in it. And so that's about it for this video. I just kind of wanted to give that brief overview of what is even managed care pharmacy, especially if you're a pharmacy student and don't have that much exposure to it from the different professors that you're around or the different professionals that you're exposed to. So if you have any questions, feel free to find me on social media at Dr. Cherokee. That's Dr. Cherokee. Um, and yes, thank you so much for watching. And that's sincerely Dr. Cherokee. Be blessed.